Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 4.04 p.m., and it's Tuesday, September 1st, 2020. Today's the first day of September, but anyway, um, today I'm going to be reviewing another one of these unique energy drinks that I got at the um, Pops Arcadia, like, you know, gas station slash museum type of thing, you know? It was cheap as like $1.50. Um, all the cans I had, though, were in bad condition, but I got the best condition one. Still, like, messed up at the top, you know, just saying. Um, but anyway, yeah, today I'm going to be reviewing the Dragon's Candy Unique Life Boost Energy Drink. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This one looks a little bit different than the last I reviewed because now the logo's big and like sideways. The unicorn dragon things. It's a little bit hard to see though too. But anyway, yeah. And anyway, it has a black top with like a, um, like a dark red tab. Bombs of production code and best by date, November 21st, 2021, so it's still fresh for a while. Around the top it says naturally flavored reishi, green tea, B vitamins. And um, Dragon's Candy, unique, 15 calories per can, life boost beverage. 12 fluid ounces, 355 milliliters. The health revolution is in full effect, and with this can in your hand, you're leading the way. Sustainable, feel good, remains defined by unique's health conscious life boost blend of reishi, green tea, and B vitamins. You're about to be swept away by the magic of Dragon's Candy, where we combined our unique blend with naturally flavored sweet red watermelon and cherry, so your dreams come alive. Stay unique. It has the SKU, so I guess it's watermelon and cherry flavored, so this one actually might be pretty good. We shall see, though. Nutrition facts are has one can amount per serving calories, 15, total fat, 0 grams, 0%, sodium, 0 milligrams, 0%. Total carbohydrates, 4 grams, 2%, total sugars, 3 grams, includes 2 grams added sugars, 5%. Protein, 0 grams, 0%. Vitamin D, 1 microgram, 6%. Potassium, 0 milligrams, 0%. Vitamin B6, 1.7 milligrams, 100%. Vitamin B12, 2.4 micrograms, 100%. Has other ingredients. Has red reishi mushroom extract and green tea extract. Um, and cane sugar. Manufactured for Unique Incorporated, Semi Valley, California. 93063. Phone number is 866-931-6225. Unique's health conscious, life boost ingredients. Red reishi mushroom extract, green tea extract, and B vitamins. Caffeine 114 milligrams per can, consume responsibly. Contains caffeine and mushroom extract. So yeah, if you probably drink a lot of these, um, the mushroom might affect you, I'm not for sure though. But anyway, yeah, drink in moderation though, you know, because it will get you lit, you know, just saying. But anyway, I'll let you see the top and bottom right quick. Sorry about the lighting, you know. Um, it's a little dark outside because, you know, it's cloudy and storming earlier. The power actually went off at my work earlier. So that was interesting. We basically got paid a free, you know, for an hour of work. And then we're in the morning, even working, you know. We're like in the break room, you know, it's dark. So, you know, free money, I guess. For me, anyway, you know, just saying. But anyway, Dragon's Candy. show it to you the best I can. It's on a labeled can. Okay, there's SKU. It's a little bit dented up at the top, you know, like pretty badly, but um, anyway, yeah, nutrition facts. the other ingredients so yeah that's pretty much the whole can so anyway oh yeah oh yeah boys oh yeah anyway I'm gonna shake it up Open it, taste it, and get my review for it. So hold on a minute. Ooh. Well, this one exploded a little bit when I opened it. And the color is like a... Um, well, it's basically like a clearish golden color. Can't really tell because it's a black top can. But yeah, it's like clearish golden... 
bit silverish, you know, but I'm mostly clear though. Very bubbly, that's for sure. But anyway, the smell. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, definitely very cherry. Um, it smells like um, like cherry Jello. Um, also like cherry chapstick a little bit. And the watermelon. Um, might smell it only a teeny bit, but um, it's mostly just the cherry, you know, like a really strong pungent cherry smell. Like, really cherry? Like, really, really cherry? Okay, anyway, um... Doesn't really remind me of, like, any energy drink smells I've had before, though. Maybe a little bit like the, um... The Cherry Bomb Beyond Raw Lit Energy Drink. It smells a little bit like that one. It smells a little bit like the Cherry Out Nos, but, um, not really. It's definitely more like a black cherry scent. Like a very strong, deep, dark cherry type of smell. But yeah, um, the watermelon though, yeah, you can't really smell it. It's mostly just the cherry. But anyway, now I'm gonna try it, so here goes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, ooh. That's a little bit of weird aftertaste, ooh. But oh yeah. First, it tastes really good, and then it gets a little bit of a weird, nasty aftertaste. Um, definitely very strong, pungent cherry flavor at first, like black cherry, but um, stronger than that, you know, like a really, really strong cherry taste. A little bitter, but definitely tart and tangy. Yeah, you can't really taste the watermelon, but um, the aftertaste reminds me of a um. A CBD like drink I've had before. It's like the mixed berry, well not mixed berry, the the kiwi strawberry um koi hemp drink that has like CBD in it. Um the aftertaste of this reminds me of that. So you know if you had that you might know what this one tastes like in the aftertaste. But imagine like a strong cherry taste at first, you know. Then that one like um hemp drink aftertaste. That's what it reminds me of anyway. Yeah, I don't know if it's because of the green tea or the reishi. Yeah, but it makes the aftertaste taste like that koi hemp, like CBD drink, you know? So it gives like a little bit of a weird taste, you know? It's actually pretty good though. Um, I think I like the one I had yesterday better than this one, but it's still pretty good though. Um, definitely a unique type of flavor for an energy drink. Cherry and watermelon. Um, you can taste the watermelon a teeny bit. It's like, um, more like the watermelon Rockstar Pure Zero. It's like that type of watermelon taste. Not really like the, you know, the watermelon, like a Mountain Dew Kickstart or anything, you know? More like the Rockstar. Definitely a little bit of a low-calorie aftertaste, too. But, um, yeah, it's like very cherry, though. Like, mostly mainly cherry, though. Probably say like 80 or 90% cherry, like only 20 to 10%, you know, watermelon. So, you know. But yeah, um, flavor wise, it could have been a little bit better if the aftertaste wasn't that weird. But you know, maybe if the cherry was a little bit more sweet and maybe more like less bitter, you know. But yeah, it has a cool can design. It's okay, price was $1.50. Energy wise, it lasts about um, two and a half hours, about four hours of energy. So, you know, it works pretty good. Has a cool can design. Yeah, the flavor could have been a little bit better, but still pretty good. I'm gonna give the Dragon's Candy Unique Life Boost Energy Drink. Um, hmm. I think I'm gonna give this one an eight out of 10. Oh yeah, boys, it's still pretty lit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. If you like cherry drinks, you'll probably like this, but um, has a little bit of a weird aftertaste though, so you know. Um, definitely reminds me of the Cherry Bomb Lit Beyond Raw Energy Drink. Um, the cherry flavor-wise, you know, reminds me of that. And also, um, this one cherry drink I reviewed on my one of my other videos is the Route 66 Black Cherry Soda. Reminds me of that, too, a little bit. Um, but yeah, it's mostly cherry, so if you like cherry, you'll probably like this. 
does have a little bit of watermelon taste and aftertaste. But I don't know if it's because of that or the green tea or the reishi that makes the aftertaste a little bit weird. So, you know, just saying. Maybe if the aftertaste wasn't, you know, that weird, you know, it'd probably be pretty good. But yeah, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. Oh, yeah, energy wise, it works good. It's cheap, has a cool design, you know, taste is okay. But yeah, I give it an 8 out of 10. Oh, yeah. Anyway, um, see you more reviews, more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.